Aloha friends! I wanted to make a um, short video and show you guys how we have decorated around <laughs> around the home and this is uh, downstairs so right now currently we are at my um, studio you guys see this in the background when I do um, show my videos of uh, especially my like smelly good video of Sensi or what um, I'm burning or melting um, or warming in my home to make it smell good so um, I have this one which is the Christmas glow I do not have that on turned on because sometimes when I have it turned on it's just that it's um, it creates like a light bulb effect within the camera but it doesn't really in um, in real life so this is the Sensi warmer of the month for the month of uh, November and then I have my snowman here. I've had this snowman forever. Uh, Costco during probably Danielle, when Danielle was born. So about 15 years now. And because we always keep it into the original box. Always, um, it stays, um, it stays in place. So two snowmen. And, um, and then this is our current Scentsy uh, warmer of the month for the upcoming month of December so this is actually not available yet that will be available on my website starting December 1st and then over here I just bought these over at Target these were at their dollar dollar spot and this is just a stocking holder with a like a ceramic uh, ceramic of a Christmas tree and then this one is a ceramic of a home this one for like three dollars each of them I think each three dollars over at the target dollar spot and then this one I just picked up one and that is also over at the target uh, dollar spot but I like those it adds a a bit of a whimsical feel to this I think all of them just goes well together so got that and then the Santa mailbox was part of their target um, holiday collection and I showed this into my um, target haul that I did a week or two ago so got that and let me go ahead and show you guys into the living room area now we are into my um, like the the wall that separates my kitchen and my uh, living room and this is I just left it as is of my regular decor and then I just pop, um, add my pop of the holiday this is my Scentsy uh, build a snowman warmer still currently available and then this is a um, the the switch that hubby has with all the the lights and then we just press a button to turn on the lights and stuff and with this one it's just like the um, all these in here are part of the switch turn it off um, no lights and then you turn it on and then everything that's plugged into that um, gets turned on and that's really nice so hubby bought that during their after after Christmas sale last year and I think got it for like two dollars and then over here is I have my I love my snowman I have my sled it says Merry Christmas the Papa snowman and the baby snowman I just call him that and um, it's metal so it's supposed to be outdoor but I like to keep them inside this is moose this is Jonathan's moose so this is gosh almost gosh almost I think 16 16 years so got this for Jonathan for his uh, first Christmas. I bought a lot of my um, holiday decor for the for the kids, especially with Jonathan being my firstborn. That's when I started really decorating for the holidays to celebrate with him. Let me um, show you guys how it's lit up. And there's my star that is a Capiz star with a gold trim around it. We got that one at Costco, I don't know, not Costco, Target last couple years ago I think Target still has it I believe and then um, we have our Snuffy Snuffy the elf came and visited um, us last night or yesterday afternoon my um, ornaments so now my ornaments is just one kind this year but like I think we used up about three or four boxes I had gotten them over at Costco they were available at Costco last year I don't think they're available this year but it has about I think 12 different ornaments let me turn off the um, I'll turn off the light and show you guys what the ornament looks like 
Over here we have uh, Santa, and Santa has a moving head with this light lantern guiding the way. And then this is where we bake the, um, the cookies for Santa and his reindeer, and we put it over there where it says cookies for Santa. And then it's got the, um, the three, two, two bears holding up the plate. Got that. And then while I'm filming for the rest, Danny's going to light up the bags for me. So she's going to do that and then I'm going to show you guys um, the ornaments. Alright, so while Danny is doing the, um, the lights for me and then she's going to line it up really nice and tight around the, the edges, I'm going to show you guys my um, ornaments. So for my lights, I have these bright like um cranberry lights i believe i got those over at target all right sorry you guys heard the garage door open that was hubby coming home and that's through the door but um these are the ornaments that i have so there's the joy and over here is the tree and then this one is a see-through glass one with the teddy bear and the rocking horse the drummer right here and then here's um, that same teddy bear train right there. And then um, another train, Joy. Then we have the Noel. Here's a rocking horse one. And there's the, the Joy. Oh, here's a mailbox one. And, and then the... The ribbon I just got over at Michael's last year, again, during their um, their holiday sale. Um, just a, a small ribbon. This time it goes all around. And that's it. And then um, this is a very old Christmas tree. We were actually going to throw it out this year. And I had bought a flocked Christmas tree. But we wanted to go ahead and just maybe um, have one last shot of using it for this year and then maybe next year we'll switch off to the to the flock one yeah so here's the light switch turn it on that's what it looks like kids love it the kids decorated the tree and then hubby put in the um the star on the very top and then over here is just um the bench that i usually have on my dining room table but because we have parties throughout the holidays it's easier just to put it here it's extra seating for people and then my dining room table just acts like a buffet table for people to just go around and get their meals. I have um, the calendar. Again, we have had this forever. All the little accessories are inside. And what I do is I put a little candy in there so that each time they open it, then they take out a little um, candy, a little treat for them. And then they start decorating Santa's uh, workshop because that's um, what this is, a Santa's workshop. And all these little toys um, hang up here. And then I have more snowman, so I have three sets of these. And then also this is a toy. I believe this was Danica's uh, first holiday toy uh, from last year. So put him up here along with my two um, snowman. And then the other set is above um, the cubbies by the door, and I'll show you guys him. But here is said there's three sets of that again this is Costco also this is Costco okay. this is um, my front door so I have two um, double doors outside it's just a simple decoration I have of a of a metal um, metal house for Christmas that's decorated I have that and then inside I have the boxwood that I have year-round I have these dollar Dollar Tree Bells that I bought last year and they still have them this year so if you guys want to pick this up it's still available over at the dollar store that I didn't really change my decor here kept it um, this one is from Target these trees uh, from Target that one along with the, um, that one right there the silver one is also from Target last year so that's there I have my nutcrackers three of them and then there's the other snowman and right. then over here this is just my everyday cubby of um like sea um sea life so my home decor is just i don't know farmhouse um, modern with um island feel and 
We have these here year round that we've found um, throughout our walks into our um, our area by the waterfront. So we find these little treasures. The kids found these, I believe, over at the waterfront. And then when we had gone over uh, with the families to, um, did we go to Ocean Shores, babe? Was it Ocean Shore? So we got that, and then the shells. This one I've had forever too. I don't. I think I had bought this at Hallmark. So I have the Joy, right here, and then over here I have Mary, and they're cute, cute little um, angelic snowmen. And that one is, and then this one is just a. I don't know. Looks like a little um, little baby boy holding a red ornament. I got that. And then this is the fresh cut Christmas tree, pine, spruce, and fir um, sign that I had gotten over at um, Target. And that was, I think, like $3. That was part of my um, Christmas haul as well from Target. And then we move over here. So hubby's just trying to watch his show. But I have, I have this little basket from Target. Oh, not Target. I'm sorry. From... Michaels and this is where I keep my blankets especially during the winter and then I, I for Starting the once it starts getting cold all the blankets around the house freshly wash Especially when we have um, kids sleeping over as well then I wash it afterwards So it's right there anybody that's warm cold can get warm and cozy really fast this is actually a box of candies before that was offered through Costco so in each little box were candies and then I kept it um, as a decoration um, I think this was as old as Danielle as well so I've had this forever and this is where Danica keeps um, keeps her toys and this one my most favorite is Jonathan's uh, gingerbread man house and look at the details on this gingerbread this was again at Costco and I believe when I purchased this it was just like 24 or 19.99 so worth it I've had this all this year Jonathan is how old is Jonathan now 17 17 okay so I've had this for 16 years so it was his first Christmas and it's my ultimate most favorite uh, decoration look at the details I believe there's something here that's broken. I just don't know. Oh, it's his, um, it's the candy cane. So this is supposed to be a candy cane. Other than that, I don't think anything is broken. And it goes all around. See? Hmm. Really love that. And then just simple, um, I have these two blocks because they're left over from the Believe sign that's um, above my mantle. And then I have this one, just added this in there. Basically, these are all my just regular decors, and I did not want to have to store them and put them away into the garage and have it all dusty and then worry about bringing it up. So I just basically add in my pop of holiday colors. This year, we went for a traditional color theme of just the gold, the green, the red, and, um, and such for, for the holiday. So we have that. This one is currently no longer available. This is the Holiday Scentsy Warmer part of the Holiday Collection. I believe it's called the Silver Frost, I think, but that is no longer available. That sold out about um, a week ago. Here's another pairing of that one. So it comes two in a box and pretty just like that. And then so here is my fireplace and <laughs> Danica, sorry. Just turning that. Derek, Danica tries to play with the, the uh, Santa Claus and Mrs. Claus. So they're just at the bottom. She's old enough now that we don't have the fireplace screen because she knows that it gets hot. We don't have her go, um, come around here and play. So we know to, even though it's off, we don't tell her to come around. So that's um, the safety part of it. But we took out the screen and now it's just um, more heating coming out of the fireplace. Here is my mantle, super simple. There is the believe sign. So the believe sign, you could also make joy. What else, babe? Joy, holiday, I believe holiday, or holly. I think it's holly, and then you have. There's, a, there's a, I think it's jolly. Oh, jolly, and then you have those 
as the end cap for that so it wouldn't fit because of um, of the what do you call these <laughs> stocking holders so the stocking holders I got last year from the dollar spot I think they were three dollars a piece over at Target the believe is from Costco a few years ago and then the stockings these stockings were from Target dollar spot um, last year and then this this year I got these um, these little stockings now this is for Jonathan Danielle Danny Danica and um, hubby and I and Java we don't have our stockings up because they're there's no room, but um, we just wanted to make sure that there was for the kids. And I love how this actually worked out to where um, I layered it. Otherwise, it would look like that plain. And then when you add the little small stockings, I think it just adds that little pop in there so that it's not as plain. I really like that. And then plus their stockings gets overfilled anyways on Christmas morning. So the, it's nice for these little stockings. You can put the little goodies in there of candies or treats and then you put the um, other bigger treats inside the bigger stocking really cute and then as far as um, this this is behind the sofa we just have we hubby and I built the um, the little table that goes behind the sofa because what happens is with our um, we have a sunken living room so then there was a empty space there because the sofa um, like butts against the um, the first or the second step one of the steps so then this one was like um like a hollow wall or hollow to it so then we just added the the table to that and built it to to fit and then we have the three Santas in there and that's it so we got that and then that one and then that one and then Again, all the blankets are nicely washed. This is um, a nice, heavy, heavy but soft blanket. And this was, um, I bought this at over at Pottery Barn years ago. So that puts a little color there of traditional um, that goes with the theme. And then it goes with the, the black and white sofa. And then so over here is our dining room table. Um, hubby and Jonathan built this table for me and then I just went ahead and uh, and painted it I think there's a video here I'm not quite sure but all it is is just chalk paint I chalk painted and then I sealed it and then there's this um, reindeer it's just the two of them as a set I bought this over at Costco last year quite heavy so nice and then it has the nice uh, wreath around around their neck that really adds it that pretty holiday look so they just go over here on top of my table and then also with this one I bought this at a clearance from Target after Christmas sale and then I kept the I think this is just to hold it um, but I kept it to hold the glass in there um, because I don't know it just makes it look a little bit more rustic I think but if I was to use it um, I would use it and then take this out and then I would probably put some uh, candies in there or um, cranberries or even like little little gold or ba um, multicolored uh, baby ornaments that you could put in there that's a nice way to decorate it over here I think it's just our final decoration to show you is my like hutch table this is where I have my white and then my um, Martha green I call it my Jadette collection and then I just use one of these. This is just something that I had um, added on to the the knob, and then that I think that just adds that nice pop of color in there to go into the rest of the holiday decor. All right, so I'm just going to show you guys. I haven't um, set it up. The tree is still in the box, but I do have an all white tree I bought over at Walmart for their after Christmas sale. I believe we just got it for like $10 after Christmas, um, the clearance. So if I was to put that up into the upstairs hallway, it would have this as the Christmas topper. It does not light up. I think I got this over at Target. And then I would have this as my lights. This one I got last year from Michaels. Again, with their nice 60 or 70% off sale. So I got a couple strands of that. And then this one is from 
Walmart this year so I wanted to put this up and then use my Cricut and add in like a Ray Dunn look of uh, different sayings in black vinyl I could do it that way or also I have a couple more boxes of these that could go into the white tree and then it would make it look like a like a candy cane theme uh, tree um, so that would be pretty and I had more of these colors to go with it but Lola which is uh, Filipino for grandma had wanted my ornaments last year so I gave it to her so then I would need I think a couple more boxes in order to fill up the tree with that so that's that's what's gonna happen right there if, if I do put up that tree upstairs in the hallway I hope you guys enjoyed this video of how we have decorated for the holidays um, very simple this year we didn't go all out just pops of color here and there just to make sure that the kids feel the the Christmas holiday spirit and as always thank you guys for visiting a simply simple life mahalo